Let's find the molar mass for C7H8. We're probably talking about toluene here, which is a pretty common organic chemical, but there are other isomers, so there probably are other ways you could arrange these into different molecules that would still have the formula C7H8. Either way, to find the molar mass, it's going to be the same process. We have carbon here, that's 12.01, and the units are grams per mole. I won't write that each time. We have seven carbon atoms, so we need to multiply that by seven. And then we'll add to that, we have hydrogen here, hydrogen, 1.01 grams per mole, and we have eight of those. So we'll multiply that by eight. So to do the math, we multiply 12.01 times seven, and then 1.01 times eight, and we add those numbers together. That gives us 92.15, and the units, grams per mole. My periodic table rounds to two decimal places. If you have more or fewer decimal places, you might get a slightly different answer out here. What this number means is if we have 92.15 grams of C7H8, that's one mole. Or if we're given one mole, the number of grams in one mole of C7H8, that's gonna be 92.15. This is Dr. B with the molar mass for C7H8. Thanks for watching.